All right, so we have transitional terms, right? And with transitional terms, we need to figure out um, the um, what's being connected, right? So um, what we have here is it's like, okay, when I was younger, I was always curious about my neighbors, right? My neighbors, their lives seem so different, right? And then we have, these are odd transitional terms in that like words like this actually transition within the sentence, Usually the usually transitional terms transition from a sentence from a sentence before and then a transitional term and then the sentence here. But what we have here, like words like although and like like, unlike, whereas transition from the beginning of a sentence to like the end. So what we have here is like like my chaotic house, right? And we have children running around and toys everywhere. Their house was always quiet and tidy, right? So we need something that's gonna be like a reverse logic. So we wouldn't want something like like, right? We would want something like, um, um, if we had unlike my chaotic house, right, with children running around and toys every year, their house was always quiet and tidy. So it would be um, answer choice D. But um, so things like whereas and although do the exact same thing, but they wouldn't be grammatically correct. I couldn't say although my chaotic house you know, their house was always quite and tidy. For things like although or like whereas, it would have to be like although or whereas, whereas my house was chaotic, right? So um, that's why answer choice A and C don't work, right? Because we'd have to like restructure the sentence. But so answer choice D, unlike my house with blah, 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 their house was always quite and tidy. So answer choice D.